dry. A little temporary setup here until they can use a couple hours a day to get them out of that cage in the house. So we can get our run made. Petey! Oh my gosh, you did have to just run through that mud, didn't you? You just stand in it. Nice. They're getting way too big for the dog cage, but Randy doesn't have time right now to build a chicken coop. So... Figured we needed a way to get them out here and protect it from the hawks or whatever might be around. So they're not messing in that dog cage so much. And just too crowded. Say, dog, leave Bubby's bike alone. Bubby just painted that. It's that paint's wet. You're gonna get yellow. Come here, please. Come here. Come here, please. Yes, yellow. Come on. Do you need a spank for not listening? Yes. Come here. Dada. Dada. The chickens? Back, 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 back. Wash the stairs. I think he decided to wash the whole yard, even though it's been raining and raining and raining. This gray one here. If you can see it, I don't know how well you can see it. It's a very nice rooster, but we need to get rid of him. Get back to him. Here he is. There he is. So, kind of wondering if anybody might need a nice rooster. Most people don't really want to keep roosters around. There he is. But they do protect your flock. And he is a very good protector. That's why I say he's a good rooster. But he's not mean to us. He's very nice to us. But we plan to keep this one here. That one there is a mean rooster, and it's going back to the farm. He's a nice guy. See, he's a little smaller, a smaller breed. Dad. 
It's not going to be like a three foot tall rooster. Why do you have paint on your hands? I told him to get away from your bike. It's not dry yet, it's not dry yet. I'm gonna dry it off. I'm just gonna dry it off. These guys are 